Has your messaging app ever randomly stopped working? That could be so frustrating. This happened to me once in the middle of a conversation. It was the worst. Have you experienced this? Comment below. Honestly, we have so many other messaging apps, but I feel like the SMS one is like pretty standard tool, right? So you need to know a couple different ways to kind of tackle this issue if it comes up. So I'm going to show you different reasons why this might happen and how to fix it for iPhone. So go ahead, take out your iPhone. The first thing you should do is make sure that your carrier network isn't down. So in order to do that, you could go to downdetector.com you might just not have like any signal for a short amount of time also depending on what area you're in so maybe just give it a couple minutes to kind of come back now the next thing we can do is make sure that airplane mode wasn't accidentally turned on for this go ahead and open your settings app there you'll see the airplane mode option toggle on that just make sure that it's not on airplane mode thing we could do is try restarting your phone that's always a safe bet everyone needs a little restart sometimes you know for that you just want to go ahead and press your volume up button and your power button at the same time so you're just gonna hold it down until the power option screen shows up like this and then use the slide to turn off um, your phone and then turn it back on using the power button once it's completely shut down. So, and then if the tips so far haven't worked, it doesn't hurt to like just head to your carrier's website and see if your account is in good standing. Like, did you miss your last payment or something? You know, we all make mistakes sometimes. So just be sure to double check that. Another thing you could do is maybe your SIM card is like not put in properly. So your SIM card, you can find it on the side of your phone. You just wanna go ahead insert um, a little pin or the SIM card uh, opener here and take your SIM card out, kind of shake it around, make sure it's in good place and then stick it right back in. Now, believe it or not, sometimes when you download a new app, it kind of messes with your phone and like makes other apps stop working. So here's how you could delete apps on iPhone. If you suspect that, oh, I just downloaded this app and then now my messenger is not working, this is what you could do. So find the app that you want to delete tap and hold on it, hold it down, and then just select remove app and then just confirm that. Okay, super straightforward, easy. Hopefully something has worked by now, but if it hasn't, we might have to take an extreme measure of like factory resetting your phone. Now this is like a nightmare for some people, but it's okay, if you know it in advance, then you can actually back up everything on your phone. So let me show you how to do that. Go to your settings app, go click general, tap on transfer or reset iPhone, select erase all content and settings, and then just follow these instructions. So you're gonna be asked to accept some options, back up the phone, verify your identity. Now, absolute last resort is to just seek professional help. So this could mean going to an actual Apple store or a third party that specializes in Apple devices. I really hope one of these options work for you. Just comment below what actually did.